Hi, I'm Neil Perry from Zen Software. In this short video, I'm going to show you a way of managing your users' deleted items folders using MailStore. One of the main problems with uh, users is that they unfortunately tend to store a lot of email in their deleted items. Uh, ideally, they want them to delete them from there at regular intervals. Um, but this is a bit of a task for asking your users to perform and typically uh, they don't. So one of the little tricks that I'm going to show you is how we can actually get MailStore to do this task for us. Now what we've got here is a very simple Exchange Mail Store setup uh, and we're using this top job here to archive all of the users mailboxes. Now you notice by default this doesn't include the deleted items, drafts, junk email or outboxes. Um, now we can simply turn that feature on and ask it to delete uh, to archive and trim down those mailboxes at the same time. Um, but the issue with doing that is it's going to follow the default rule and for this rule we've decided to delete any messages it finds that are older than one year. Now deleted items typically you don't need to keep them as long as one year. So a nice little trick is if you copy this job and we paste it here Let's rename this so we can make it a bit clearer and we're going to make this the, the job that looks after just the deleted items. If we now go and edit that job, in all intents and purposes it's exactly the same as the job that we've created but in the folders that I'm going to look at I'm only interested in looking at the deleted items. So I'm going to turn off the option to exclude the deleted items, drafts, junk email and outbox here and add just to this specific folder. So now we're only looking at the deleted items folder for all of the users. So we can specify a more specific time range. So instead of being every one year, or, or, or deleting messages older than one year, we'll make it delete messages older than one week. I'm still going to uh, do this for all users. I'll finish the job. Now I could run this manually and it would run now uh, and it would delete all the messages it finds older than one week or typically I would schedule this job to run once a day at a different time uh, to the other job so for this one we'll run it at 1am as a system account. That'll create a task. So now every night at one, well, at 1 o'clock in the morning it will prune all the users deleted items folders for any messages that it finds older than one week.